I, I thought the first, um, you know, three innings, I thought he pitched fine. I mean, we, we you know, um, didn't complete a double play ball, and that led to one of the runs, certainly. So I thought he, I thought the first three innings he pitched well. The two hits in the first inning were just kind of seeing eye singles. You know, really, to me, I mean, he, you know, after the, you know, R Rosario home run, he just, the, the, the walks to Castro and Polanco was what's, what was, um, you know, a little, what was the puzzling thing to me. You know, he just felt like he lost um, a little bit of feel of the strike zone. Um, starting with the eight and the nine hitters, and then obviously the big pitch to Dozier did a lot of damage. So it just, it happened fast, you know. Um, and it was, you know, that we're at 4 3 lead even after Rosario's home run, and certainly a chance to still keep the game together. His pitch count was in really good shape. And, um, you know, really after that, after Rosario home run, he just he struggled. What kind of momentum swing is that when you guys, you know, have that nice inning in the fourth to take the lead and then things kind of get away from you in a hurry like that? Well, yeah, I mean, a six run inning is, is always going to be really tough to come back from. So. Um, you know, we, we swung the bats better tonight, I think. I think it was a, a, g a good night swinging the bats, but, um, you know, the, the big inning uh, hurt us, and obviously a grand slam is going to kill you. I think that was the first pitch. Do you think that you know, your Matt was struggling, they just figured now he's got to throw strikes? And... Yeah, I mean, I, you know, a quality fastball is Matt's, Matt lives with quality fastballs, and, and he's. Um, you know, he, he can do that when a hitter knows it's coming. He can throw a ball, you know, in or away, up and in or away and, and get a double play ball there. I mean, with double play ball, you're out of the inning there, and it's 4-3 game. So, um, you know, he was one pitch away still from getting out of that inning. But um, obviously Dozier took advantage of something over the middle of the plate. With the, uh, the length that you got from J.J. and, and Jared, were you in good shape? Yeah, team? we're all right. I mean, and J.J., you know, um, you know, he, he threw a bunch of pitches tonight, so obviously he'll 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 be down tomorrow. But um, you know, Carlos got out of that inning really fast, so so he'll be he'll be good tomorrow. And Jared did a really nice job, being a fish in over two innings. So um, well, we're in decent shape, actually, considering um, you know considering the short start. During the, the struggle to score runs, your starting pitch has been really good. Um, just one of those nights where. It's yeah, I mean, you haven't had many like this. Or... No, it's just it was it was yeah, it just wasn't a good night uh, for Matt. Um, and like you said, I mean, I think he's he's been pitching, he's been in a pretty good groove for a while now, and, and done a really nice job, and been very consistent with with quality starts and giving us a chance to win. So tonight wasn't his night. Some approach kind of flipped on you, didn't it? Two runs started and three. Yeah, yeah, it was. Um, you know, we, you know, three losses to end it. Two tough games, kind of in the middle, that that uh, could have gone either way. But um, look, man, we're, we're still, you know, we got to look. You know, it's, it's it's a time for us to say, hey, you know, a couple of good days, and, and we're sitting in a really nice spot, and we're not we're sitting in a good spot right now. So we got to, you know, it, it doesn't feel good losing the last three, but um, you know, we we still have opportunity in front of us.